Okay, I'm here with Starfine in Comic Con. I was just wondering, um, have you found any other Teen Titans yet? Uh, yeah, actually, I found everyone. Uh, there was a cyborg, uh, uh -huh. two Beast Boys, like mm -hmm. four or five Ravens, uh -huh. uh, and like loads of Robins uh, running around. So. If, if I see them around, hopefully I could uh, have a chat and see if uh, um, they say you're as nice as you are uh, in the comics and uh, uh, I try to be. Yeah. Okay, so what got you into um, Comic Con? Um, well, I've always loved like comics mm -hmm. and um, i watched Teen Titans. I've watched it since I was like a little kid. Yeah. And because I've watched it for so long, um, I just kind of fell in love with the characters. And it actually, only my kind of mild obsession, uh, so to speak, only really started uh, maybe last year yeah. uh, when I decided I wanted to have all the, because the TV series stopped. So I wanted to have them all on DVD so I could watch them if I wanted to. So I bought all the DVDs and then I kind of just got really into it. And I've always loved Starfire because she's like, she's an amazing woman who's this alien, she's in line for the throne, she gets kidnapped, sold into slavery, mm -hmm. and then she fights her way out, um, finds stuff on Earth, doesn't speak the language, doesn't know what to do, and she's stuck there and she makes friends and she sorts herself out and she becomes this amazing person. Um, so I think it's just the mix of like kind of loving anime, and loving cartoons and drawings and all that and then also the fact that you grew up with that as a child that got me into it. Okay, okay there's an interesting um, sort of uh, conversation that's been going around where uh, fans of the original Teen Titans, some of them are not too happy about Teen Titans Go. What's your view on it? Um, Teen Titans Go is like a kids version of it. Yeah. it, it I think it is to be taken as a kids version of it, like don't take it seriously. Yeah they're going to mess up and they're going to try and ship like Raven and Beast Boy don't want to offend anyone there. If you think they should be shipped, it's your yeah. cool. Um, and like they, they do try and overdo some things, but like at least it's still running. At least people are still seeing it. And you know, Teen Titans is like, it's my childhood. And I would rather it still existed as Teen Titans Go and another kid grew up with it and another kid had that kind of to bounce back off of rather than um, for it to have died out when the original series stopped. And yeah. as much as it is like a kid's thing, um, and it's not as great, obviously it's not as great as the original series or as the comic, um, it's still funny and it still has its its pros. Um, you can hate me for saying that, but um, yeah, I, I mean, I wouldn't say it's the best Teen Titans thing that exists, but it's still Teen Titans. It's still being shown in the air. And uh, as far as I'm concerned, if it's making little kids happy, that's like all you really need to be there to do. Oh, definitely, definitely. I'm just wondering, so how long have you um, cosplayed for? Uh, about a year now, okay. so not long. Okay, so what, uh, what other characters have you cosplayed? Um, I've done Lara Croft. Uh -huh. um, I'm hoping to do Alka from Sword and Blade. Uh -huh. um, and I've done a few other little random ones. Um, nothing really springs from the top of my head because I haven't really done this Comic Con. Uh -huh. uh, but yeah, Starfire and Lara Croft. Okay, and what's your favourite one so far? Uh, I really enjoyed doing Starfire. Yeah. Uh, I put a lot more work into it. Yeah. Um, and it's it's a character that I really know a lot about, that really speaks to me, uh, that I think also parallels with my, my personality a little bit as well. So that's why I love doing her so much. Cool, cool. And what would you do if you saw Blackfire? Um, well, Starfire, as a character, has always been really friendly to her sister, and it's Blackfire has always not been friendly to her. Yeah. Um, there's like four different backstories as to their relationship, and it always ends with Starfire uh, trying to be friends. So if I did see a backfire, I'd definitely go up and say hi, yeah. um, and maybe get a photo, probably. Um, probably yeah. But like, I wouldn't have a problem with it. If anything, I think as a cosplayer, uh, seeing characters, even if it's characters you're supposed to hate in the uh, in the film or TV series, yeah. you kind of love that they're there. Um, and you know, if villains kind of make the, the TV series. Because uh, without the villains, there's no superheroes, so, you know. Okay, thank you very much for that interview. Just give me your best pose and we'll uh, close out. There we go.